Welcome back to the program. Uh, joining me now is the interim general manager of the Arkansas State Fair, Anne Marie Doramus. She is also a game and fish commissioner, but we're just going to wear a state fair hat today. Good to see you. Good to see you too, Roby. Uh, thanks for having me on. End of your first week of the state fair. You've had some great weather. You've had some big crowds. Everything's gone pretty swimmingly, I would say. How do you uh, how do you think it's going so far? You know, it's gone off without a hitch, so I'll, I'll take it. You're right. The weather's been great. Uh, people are excited to get out. Uh, you know, we were we took a year off because of uh, the pandemic, which was the right thing to do. Uh, now, we did still have our livestock show in pageant last year, actually, um, but this is our uh, first year back uh, with the carnival and the food, and uh, everyone's out there. They're having a great time, enjoying themselves, and uh, we couldn't ask for anything more. Uh, the State Fair is obviously an Arkansas tradition uh, from the music to the, the animals, the livestock that you talked about, the emphasis on agriculture, the rides, the games, the, uh, the food that you mentioned there. What is your favorite part of the State Fair? Oh my goodness. Of course, I love the carnival and I love the food, but Roby, I have to be honest with you. Actually, my favorite part is probably the livestock and the pageant aspect of it. And here's why. Uh, not that I have a livestock uh, background or even a pageant background, but the opportunities that we're giving for these kids to uh, earn money to go towards their education or in livestock to go towards the care of their animals um, is really, really great. Um, so the more uh, that we can get out there and promote that and show the good that we're doing. We're more than just a carnival and food and rides. Uh, I think that's important. So, and also the fair has a great economic impact, not only to the state of Arkansas, but to the city of Little Rock. Uh, all the people, you know, coming in from all across the state, even outside of the state uh, for not just the carnival, but for the pageant and the livestock show. We're talking, you know, 400 hotel rooms, uh, buying fuel, golly, 5,000 fair workers. We're providing jobs out there uh, and 45,000 people fed <laughs> throughout the 10 days of the fair. So a lot of really good positives going, going along with it. Yeah, you struck a, a, a chord that I wanted to touch on there, a thread I wanted to touch on. And that is at the end of the day, the state fair is a business. Um, what do the right. profits from the state fair go to? I don't know if everybody really knows all that. So so, you know, the fairgrounds is actually owned by the state of Arkansas and uh, the Arkansas State Fair and Livestock Association is a 501c corporation. So uh, we actually, you know, put out all the money back into that. And of course, we have to pay out the carnival and all of our expenses, but it all goes back into the fair uh, to get ready for next year to host this again. So that's uh, that's where it goes. And then, of course, there's uh, county fairs all around the state of Arkansas. It all goes hand in hand. All right. Um, I understand that there is a funnel cake burger this year and that you may have even eaten one. Is this true or false? I may have had a bite of it, Roby. And you know what? Uh, while it's, uh, it's not something that's on my diet, that one bite that I took was savory and delicious. I highly, highly recommend it. In fact, uh, the other day uh, I was doing an interview and uh, I can't say that I've ever had cheese fries at 5 30 in the morning until until then so yeah it uh yeah i was at the the stand uh that's everything is uh bacon themed so everything's wrapped in bacon or has bacon on top of it so that was one of the deals that i tried so i'm slowly eating my way through the fair is the moral of the story it's a good thing it's just a two-week event for sure right thank thank goodness <laughs> I, I don't know if uh i don't know if i could handle it <laughs> but right. it sure is fun. Uh, Anne Marie, I'll give you one last chance to make a make a pitch to everybody. Golly, well, obviously uh, we're coming in on the last day of the fair. Uh, it's closing in really quick. It's a great time to come out and just enjoy enjoy time with your family. Uh, you know, after the pandemic, we've all been uh, cooped up for a while. It's nice to get back to some sort of normal and get back and enjoy one of Arkansas's greatest traditions. So come on out, see us, and have a great time. All right. Thank you for being with us this morning. I appreciate you. Thank you, Roby. We'll be back with more right after this.